It's time for the lightning cartoon <laughs> show. <laughs> little thing. There's the voiceover we need. It's the great gas rush tonight, helping the evacuees, and Tina Vey gets more job security. Our guest tonight's not only the voice of Space Ghost Coast to Coast, but is in high demand as a voiceover specialist these days. The man of a thousand voices, George oh, Lowe, is yeah. back on the lane. God help me, the phone never stops ringing. <laughs> Hi, guys. Oh. Good to see you, buddy. Oh, well, first off, Paul's had a busy week. Yeah. But, busy, but, busy know, three weeks. Actually. It's unbelievable. Yeah. And, of course, you know, in this wacky season where the, the easterly breezes and yeah. the, the westerly breezes, all of that gets in the middle of the state. <laughs> the next thing you got to watch out for, of course, is, is your Godzilla attacks, <laughs> which are inevitable. <laughs> it's, it's inevitable. We can you see that on, on Omni. That's what Omni is good for. Is That's exactly. It's watching Godzilla attack. for your Godzilla attack. So, do you carry oh, this around wherever you go? Oh yeah, wherever I go, I have. <laughs> I have always got Godzilla with us in the <laughs> car. And, and you know, for you kids at home, uh, remember Monday Godzilla. This is a five-day. Uh, yeah. Here's our five-day Godzilla forecast, Paul. <laughs> Monday Godzilla. Tuesday and Wednesday more Godzilla. Wow. Thursday Godzilla pushing off to the east. Paul, do I have it right? That's pushing nice. off to Bend the your east. Bend your knees so you don't hurt your back. Bend the knees. <laughs> pushing off to the east, but but Friday make way unfortunately for Rodan. You know, well, Rand, that was great. That, that was good. Keep on going. Had there been uh, any what's kind next? of pre tape you know, what's next? <laughs> the, Jeez. The, uh, I the told great, you it was going to be no, a real tough no, 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 experience no, no. tonight. The, the, uh, the great gas rush, uh, specifically here in Florida. So we're going we know. from Godzilla to We're going to gas from Godzilla to gas. Well, it's a, it's yeah. a no leap, if you will. Yeah. Yeah. In this the, hurricane, <laughs> the hurricane effect coming through with the gas prices. All of a sudden, they've come back down, so now they're prosecuting, or at least they're looking at prosecuting these gas stations who jacked up all these prices. Because I'm sure you were not one of those who ran out on Friday and filled your Take up with gas. You, you, you know, it, it's funny, Paul. I'm sure yeah. you'll agree. It, it's it's tougher than ever to gas up the car. But you folks at home, remember, you can always gas up the family plenty cheap at Taco Kingdom. Now in Lutz with three locations, still 85 cents a bag. Taco Kingdom for all of your taco needs. <laughs> There's your supply already. That's right. How about the evacuees? Here's my gripe of the day. You know, with all due respect, evacuees. To, this to ought the, to be comedy no, gold. Well, the, the the evacuees who ended up leaving and were thankfully taken, getting taken care of. Those who decided not to evacuate and to stay behind. If I hear another soundbite on the news from somebody who stayed behind in Galveston is asking for food and water relief mm. supplies and help, I'm going to get well, really been, mad. We've, we've These actually, people should. No, have you're left. right. And we, we try to tie this into, into our, our local area because we have had numerous phone calls and folks that say, that say I'm just not going to go. Hopefully they've, they've watched what happened, has happened over in Galveston, and maybe next time we have one approaching us, they'll decide to leave. And a reminder, because people still don't get this, is that you're evacuating from the water. If you live in Polk County... There's no need to evacuate because you are obviously not in a flood zone. Not but, unless you surge. want to. I mean, if, if, you, live, if you live in Florida, <laughs> you, you never want to leave. You may just want to leave on your own recourse. <laughs> but, that, but that wouldn't take a hurricane. No. 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 Now, now, what about the knuckleheads? And I know exactly what you guys are talking about. What, what about Nils Bohr's illegitimate cousin there, the other nuclear physicist, who decides to go, what was it, wind surfing or, or parasailing yes, in the for, last uh, one? And the guy yeah, the weeks ago. broke every bone in I his know. body. I know. Before we go, we've got to talk about Tina Fey. It was quite the skit. She's the dead ringer for Palin. She is, she is beyond cute, too. I, I, I liked her before anybody else liked her. I thought she was oh. always, even with the scar. She got in a punchline fight with Kathy Griffin. You know how that's happened. Kathy, she apparently stole a line and Kathy cut her. <laughs> it's true. That's what happened. And uh, you scar and all, I think she's I was, very, I was very a little cute. concerned for, for Phelps, though. He was he struggled a little bit, but I think he survived. Guy, was, remember, not, remember he's a when swimmer. doing comedy. He's a swimmer. Exactly. Don't be bringing in the sports people when you want the comedy. That's just why Russell could... Simmons hadn't brought in Tiger Woods yet to do. It's a deaf comedy jam. You know, was gonna do 30 minutes on putters. It'd be like W. Bring, bring W and do 30 minutes. On <laughs> we gotta run. George Lowe, thanks so much for coming yeah, by. Yeah. And Godzilla. What happened here? Did we do anything, Paul? <laughs> Lovely to see you. Oh, warm front. I just like saying.